Now let us study the types of simple vapor compression refrigeration cycle one by one. The first type that is nothing but dry saturated vapor after compression. It means इसका मतलब क्या है Point number टू कहाँ पे होगा On saturated vapor line. And here somewhere I will get point number वन तो वन टू टू क्या हो गया आइसेंट्रोपिक कॉम्प्रेशन प्रोसेस देन टू टू थ्री क्या होगा कॉन्स्टेंट प्रेशर हीट रिजेक्शन प्रोसेस देन थ्री टू फोर इज नथिंग बट आइसेंथलपिक एक्सपांशन एच थ्री इज इक्वल टू एच फोर एंड फाइनली जो आपका फोर टू वन है दैट इज नथिंग बट वॉट कॉन्स्टेंट प्रेशर हीट एडिशन और द प्रोसेस इन विच वी आर गेटिंग द रेफ्रिजरेशन इफेक्ट नाउ सेम साइकिल वी हैव टू प्रिपेयर ऑन टी एच आर्ट नाउ वन टू टू इज नथिंग बट वॉट आइसेंट्रोपिक प्रोसेस आई कैन राइट हियर यस वन इज इक्वल टू यस टू पॉइंट नंबर वन पॉइंट नंबर टू 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 थ्री इज नथिंग बट वॉट टू टू थ्री इज नथिंग बट वॉट कॉन्स्टेंट प्रेशर हीट रिजेक्शन देन थ्री टू फोर इज नथिंग बट वॉट आइसेंथलपिक एक्सपांशन प्रोसेस एंड फाइनली फोर टू वन इज नथिंग बट वॉट कॉन्स्टेंट प्रेशर हीट एडिशन प्रोसेस नो हियर वट वी नीड टू डू वी नीड टू कैलकुलेट the values of different enthalpies which values of enthalpies were in need of now let us do the analysis is a dry saturated vapor after compression now as we are knowing that the coefficient of performance of refrigerator or energy performance ratio is equal to refrigeration effect produced to the compressor work now After simplification, what I can write here: refrigeration effect produced is H one minus H four divided by compressor work is during one to two process. That is H two minus H one. Now, if I will get the values of this H one. H two and H four easily I can calculate the value of coefficient of performance. Now how we can calculate the values of H one, H two and H four? Now see here how we can calculate the value of H one. H one is equal to what I can write. It is present inside this vapor dome. Means I can write H one is equal to H up one. Plus x one into h f g one. Now similarly, how we can calculate the value of h two? H two is equal to that point number two is on saturated vapor line. Means I can write here h g two. That is nothing but what h two. Similarly, if I have to calculate the value of H four, we are knowing that H four is equal to what? H three, as it is isenthalpic process, and how we can calculate that H three? That H three is equal to what? Simply H F three. Okay. Means we can modify this equation as h one minus h four is nothing but what h three divided by h two minus h one. Or this h three is nothing but what directly I can write this h three is nothing but what h one minus h f three divided by H two minus H one. Now here, in case of this H one value, here we need to find out the value of x one. Let us say that the value of x one is not given. 
in that case how we can calculate the value of x1 now here as we are knowing that 1 to 2 is isentropic compression process means what i can write s1 is equal to s2 okay and we can write s1 is equal to sf1 plus x1 into sfg1 and s2 is equal to sf2 plus x2 into sfg2 but if you will pay close attention towards this point number 2 then what I can write this x2 is equal to 1 means what I can write therefore s2 is equal to sf2 plus sfg2 or directly I can write here sg2 and here we are knowing that s1 is equal to s2 therefore i can write s1 is what s f1 plus x1 into s f g1 is equal to s2 is nothing but what s g2 now in this equation we are knowing the value of s f1 s f g1 and s g2 easily i can calculate x1 is equal to how much now this value of x1 i can put into this equation so that i will get the value of h1 is equal to now i am knowing all the values i am knowing the value of h1 then i am knowing the value of h3 and i am knowing the value of hg so that easily i will get the value of cop of refrigerator this is the analysis of dry saturated paper after compression hopefully you might have enjoyed the lecture then please do like the video and know your thoughts in comments please do share this video among your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel after subscription you can press the bell icon to never miss the notification regarding our new videos thank you thank you so much